I just saw a post online by AYSA grassroots soccer class and you need it before you get your uh, D license, I guess. They're adding all these new things. So you, you can get your Y1, your Y2 license. You can get your F license, the E, the D, then the C, then the B, then the A, then the director of coaching license, uh, your uh, director of operations license, your license to uh, coach kids, license to uh, kick a ball, uh, license to teach the toe poke pass, the license to receive, uh, the ball the inside your foot. You can get a license um, how to uh, make sure your kids uh, tuck in their shirts properly. You can get licensing, licensing in anything. And they keep adding it. And they, now we have a course on grassroots soccer. Um, I should just take the class so I can heckle the AYSA person that's running it so they can make money. So obviously, you know, it, it just, golly, US soccer has so much money it and this is my problem i'm just so dumb you know i'm too busy calling these people out versus why don't i just sell to them some idea and then they can make the whole country do it problem is you got to know people and not so uh, i don't know they, someone got to the u.s soccer people and say hey if we could just teach our coaches about grassroots soccer it would change the whole world in soccer grassroots soccer so i guess it's it, I, i'm just so fed up with all these money grabs it, how about go on the internet and read you know or go to the library you you, you want to or study history where the best players coming from i mean do but but we want to create a class it's just so silly it's kind of like you know back in the day when basque uh, underwater basket uh, weaving classes were real before they ended those programs. There's always someone trying to do something to get money. It just, there's all this stuff. It, it, it will never end. Money is the root of all evil. It's so true. We have that problem. We have talent in the U.S. We have so much talent here. And we just don't know how to get it. And it's crazy. You know, and uh, I don't know. It it is what it is. Grassroot soccer license license exists. Oh, we are saved now. We we can grassroot our coaches. Flipping stupid. Um, all right, whoever you are running that class, grassroot soccer, and I, and I get I probably should take the class, but you know I don't want to pay the five hundred bucks or whatever it costs to take that dumb class. So I can sit around with a bunch of non-soccer players. And that's what it is. It's a lot of non-soccer players, especially at that level, that, that just want to you know, think they can learn something and, and they can implement it versus being from the culture of soccer and actually lived it, failed at it, overcame it, failed again, you know, not, you know, not dealing with real people. You, you know what we need? We need classes with people that have been through the system of soccer with a lot of people that, uh, a lot of coaches that are technical. I just want to talk to technical coaches. That is it. Get, give me all the high technical coaches. And there's actually, there's quite a few in Arizona, you know, but they're not from the US. They're from Yugoslavia, Serbia, Spain, Italy. And they're technical because they're from technical countries. They're, the cultures of soccer exist over there. You know, so I didn't say England. You know, in England, they don't play. I went to England. I couldn't find a game. There's no games in England. Like, I couldn't get a pickup game anywhere. Can't find games there. The podcast you just heard was recorded with Anchor. If you want to make your own, download the Android or iOS app completely free from anchor.fm slash podcast. That's anchor.fm slash podcast.